guys, welcome back to the channel. This morning we went out for a little fish with a Joel and Isabel, a back to basics lesson. It was great. Went out on the beach and just had some fun. We went over a few rigs, knots. It was it was really a really good a good time. And and that's what I love. Uh, I love getting the kicks out of teaching people. Um, you know, I was lucky to have learnt fishing from a early age, and not everyone has had that opportunity. So, you know, we all just do what we can, and this is my way of doing what I can and yeah this morning was a really fun fun vibe fun, fun loving couple these, these guys um so anyway yeah we'll, we'll get into it Yeah, some nice uh, size, nice fat sand right in there. No, I didn't. Big fat sand whiting these guys are. What a feed, mate. What a feed. Yeah. It's probably probably a bigger one. Yeah. You gonna eat it? There's no size limit. It's up to you. Where are you? Give him a wash. Do you want a, a photo? You want to hold it up and get a photo? Awesome. I got the bike back too. Nice. Yeah. No size of it on pairing or sand whiting. You're not going to hold it? show you how to hold it if you want. It's pretty hard to hold. From the front, they're very easy. They're smooth. Yeah. So from the from the front, they're smooth as, see? I knew, I knew I'd give a bell and go to the <laughs> Just don't go against the grain. <laughs> and um, when you do grab it, if, if you want to get a grip of it, you could get a grip in here if you, if you want to. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if I want to. <laughs> it's up to you. Well, my hands are covered. 
Oh, I'll take a photo if you like. Uh. Okay, now we'll squirm. Yep. Oh, you got a good hold on it. Yep. <laughs> Do you want it on this one? Yeah. <laughs> Wash your hands if you like. <laughs> yeah, good, good stuff. And after a while, like, you catch your whiting and herring, and um, and then you know we can look at the different rigs as well. You can put whole, whole whiting on, or whole herring, or fillets. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's a whiting. Yeah. Fat. Love them. So good, eh? That was an octopus. <laughs> yeah. I usually got a feed of quality, mate. Yeah. Well, huh? <laughs> <That's right. laughs> it's true. It's not much for me. It looks alright. I mean, I'm not getting bites all the time. Oh, I've had, I've had a few. oh good, oh good. Yeah, I'm leaving it out there, I'm waiting, like, yeah. might not get a bite for five minutes or something. Yeah. Cool, cool. This is Muley. Yeah, I always come on. Oh yeah. Oh Joel, look on Joel. Yeah. Another herring. Wow. Woo. Yeah, nice, nice. Zip is nice. Yeah. Good feed, good feed, yeah. Why and then Lovely, I know, it's spun out. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I saw that. Yeah! Yeah, we I was just gliding out there. Good. Very good. Everything alright? Oh, I can't get this old octopus off. Oh, here. Yeah. How do you Scissors. Super stuck on there. I was trying to get a flyer. No. So you just cut near the bottom and you, and you just pull it and you keep cutting near the bottom. Mm. Must have put it on there pretty good. Yes. <laughs> well done. With this one, how are you putting those? Oh, I'm putting... Oh they do. Fall off a bit. They do, yeah. Like the they will come one bite and it'll be gone. Yeah. And no matter, even if I put it, even if I do it for you, one bite and it's gone. Yeah. Okay. I just mean like, because when I cast it, I might not 
Now the soft bit, I'll go through the soft, the white, yeah. and I'll thread it through, and then I'll go the hard, the dark. Like Taylor salmon, um, yeah. So you, well, I'll, I'll show you. I'll give you. I'll show you a couple of ways to do it. Dead, dead or alive. Obviously, live bait is always going to be the best, and then encourages better fish. Dead baits, okay, but also encourages scavengers like sharks and stuff. Ray. So with the dead baits, often we will um, use a herring and use a fillet of a herring and um, use a fillet and, and then I'll take that fillet and I'll cut that fillet again so that there's four pieces to it and then I'll um, usually put it on a single like this yeah, and uh, and because it's a long strip, I will thread it, thread it, thread it, and leave probably leave a little bit hanging off. The different rigs that you can use for that gen general beach rig, um, I find the best is to have uh, for the big stuff. Um, uh, you got your swivel and a short line to a sinker, and then a long line to your hook. That way, your sinker usually just obviously sits in the ground, and your line uh, uh, is in the current. Um, this is for the big stuff, not for the because the, the big stuff because um, because they are big. When they take the bite, one little and you can feel it. It's not like the little stuff. Yeah, it's like you can you can feel it straight away. Live baiting is best always. You know. But you do have to keep the fish alive, of course. And uh, this is the this is the lateral line here. Yeah. That's an organ on the fish. If it's damaged, it'll die. Now with that, with that, they can. It's like a super sense. So that's their lateral line. When you when you catch them, I I, I use a live. I use this this size hook as well for sort of this size um, the livey. And it just goes through the shoulder on the top above the lateral line and make sure the point comes out the other side as well. Above the lateral line. Don't don't want to damage it. And then you just cast it out, you can leave it in there and hope for the best. Um, but casting it out, obviously when it lands, can stun the fish. Also, um, you know, you try casting a bait this big and you're only going to get 10 metres or something, not very far, you know. 
So what we have is what was called a slide bait rig. You heard of that? A slide bait rig is this. And then the fight's on. You do that a bit off the rock. Yeah. Half of my big fish are on this, and the, and the other half are on lures. But you know, you don't have to start like that. You can start on a beach in the morning, mutton bird, whatever, to catch your whiting, you catch your herring. Go for um, a dead bait. Go for um, an example of a gang hook. It's a hook that's gang one, two, three gang. And um, this is good. The same sort of rig that I explained for short line to your sinker, a bit longer to your hooks, which is going to be like your gang hook. Then you can, um, I mean, if you if you got a a, a small whiting, it's not going to fit. These are too big, these ones. But if you get a small whiting, you can put it on. Otherwise, muleys are excellent. Although muleys do come off quite easy, you have to be aware of that. And what you do is you start at the bottom, that backbone of the hook and the backbone of the fish, and you sort of line up where the eye is going to go into the first hook. And I'll explain the reason for that. The eye is going to go about there, so I'll put this base in here and in, and move up to the next one. Go in, move up, and it should be about right, yep. Okay? Beautiful there. To finish it off, you can cut that on an angle. Like that. And that's pretty good to go. Um, the reason we do that with the eye is because it's the toughest part of the fish. The skeleton, the skull, yeah. Holes are pretty tight. And yeah, and then like you got your sinker, so this is just like in the... That's something decent for that. Yeah, Taylor, salmon. Use this, you do do it at um, Martin Bird or wherever you go, even uh, metros. This will work heaps, yeah. <laughs> yeah, might have, eh? Definitely looks flat out there, man. Quieting down a bit. Yeah. Oh, lad. Probably get skippy now. different maybe skippy skippy skipjack very good to eat Yep. Oh, <laughs> yeah, really good to eat. Do they have size or are they the same as? No. Like all of these. Oh yes, yeah, 25 centimeters actually. Like, you can eat him. You want to eat him? Yeah. Try him out? Yeah. You'll love him. <laughs> if, I, if, if you don't, at least you've got a few different fish here to try. Oh. A lot of fish there. Are you taking photos? <laughs> Have you got family with you or are you just used to? It's us, so, 
Turning it up there. <laughs> well, um, yeah, whatever you, whatever you want, man. Like, well, easy. Take as much as you think that you will eat, and whatever you want, we will. I think so. That's the area. Sure is, eh? Oh really? Like Pretty close. Nearly on the sand in there. Oh yeah. You, you're sussing it out, man. Yeah. Well done, mate. <laughs> so good. Herring and whiting, mainly. What size is the herring? man hmm? beautiful on fab's tours <laughs> catch fish. yeah lucky we moved there eh? you were pretty confident about catching fish whiting though yeah 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 yeah, yeah. Like, I, i'm not these guys are everywhere yeah. so we should be able to fish you'll be able to catch them yeah mutton bird scarborough whiting all over the place Good starter. Oh shit, yeah, that tastes so good. One of the top fish in the, in the sea, eh? Just, it's amazing, too easy. So, so many of them, and they're one of the best. It's gotten pretty quiet. Get my bait back. Now, it's starting to get the hang of it. We're good. Oh, yeah. yeah. You can actually feel the line. Oh, yeah. You're whipping it now. Yeah, but every now and then I dump it like straight down. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Accidents. Like Old habit. You'll lose it. Oh, you only cut the throat, like you bleed them. Yeah. And um, you only bleed them and icky jimmy in the head. You know what icky jimmy is? Spiking in the brain for immediate death. And uh, so you want to you icky jimmy, you want to cut the throat and spike them with a knife or something. And, and that's it. You don't cut it, don't clean it yeah. until you're ready to go home or whatever. Just leave it whole. Getting hard to catch now. Let's body. Getting me bait back. Oh, it's a bit more difficult to fish and to feel the bites and that. You ready to? Yeah. Oh, yeah? Yep. Yeah. You yeah. Sure have. Got a good feed there. I will. Have you got a knife? Yeah, that one there. This one yours? Yeah. Alright. Oh, yeah, that's your sinker. Keep it. Keep it. Yeah. Oh, my pleasure. Yeah. 
No, that, that's an excellent lie. Um, catch a whole bucket of fish. Yeah. Well, oh, you're well, on your... Well, I you you would have. <laughs> given time, you would have as well. <laughs> it's just practice. Do what you did here. Anywhere and you will score. We have practice tomorrow. Yep. Catch anything? Yeah, lots of whiting. Yeah. Good one. Thanks. That was epic, man. Thanks so much. Yeah, my yeah, pleasure, really mate. Enjoyed it. Nice. Yeah, great fun. Very much wild. Good, good. And message any time, eh? Yeah. If you need to, if you're not sure, hey, is this poisonous or not, or yeah. whatever, you know? Alright, oh, that's awesome. Yeah, yeah just in case. Thanks, Isabel. Oh, thank you. Yeah, no worries. Good, uh, so have fun uh, the rest of your trip and that. And, uh, yeah, we will. We'll enjoy the fish. Mm, we're good. That was a good day. Thanks for everything. Awesome. Thanks thank so you. much. Yeah, it was really awesome. Thanks, Fab. No worries. See you guys. Yeah.